could be a chance for Soldell. Soldell lifts it over Baum. And Marvin Soldell scores his first goal for Burnley to put Sean Dyche's side ahead here at White Hart Lane with less than three minutes on the clock. Quite brilliant finish outside the left foot. All it was was a straight pass down the middle. He bounced, Soldell was onto it, and he just slammed that into the top left-hand corner. Spurs ball is just inside the D. It's going to be Wallace to take it. It is over the wall. It bounces off a Tottenham player and goes in. And Burnley extend their lead. Wallace's free kick, I think, took a deflection off a Tottenham player on the way in, but it went in anyway. And we have played less than eight minutes. And Tottenham have got a mountain to climb if they want to continue in the FA Cup. Andres Townsend pulling forward, left footed ball in, onto the head of Soldano, Polinius there! And Tottenham get a goal back, the ball whipped in from the right hand side, Soldano flicked it onto Paulinho, we've had three goals in this game in less than ten minutes. Delicate touch from Soldano, Paulinho was in there, in the danger area, and off his chest control, he's then hit a volley into the corner, and Spurs are right back in this. Work and bounces out of play. Davis plays the ball into the penalty area, doesn't quite fall to Paulinho, comes back to the blue. And what a strike from the Tottenham midfielder! A powerful effort from Etienne Cafu makes it all square here just before the break. It dropped it in the edge of the D, and there was no stopping that Exocet missile. It's Tottenham 2, Burnley 2. Paulinho takes it and it goes in at the far post and it's Kirikez who got it. It was whipped in that corner. Kirikez just inches out. He had an opportunity a few moments ago from open play and he has given Tottenham the lead in his FA Cup third round replay for the first time this evening. It's with Danny Rose who's playing on the left-hand side of midfield. He's using the stand moving. Saldo goes after. 